Wednesday at seven there with Shadows Got Darker East, BBC Radio Sheffield and Rob from the band joins me now. Hello, Rob. Hello, Ali. How are you doing? So good. Thank you so much for coming on the show on this Friday night. So this tune, it came out yesterday, the 12th of October. How was that? How are you feeling about it being out there? Yeah, I must admit it's exciting because we've been writing music since around February. Um, so to actually have it out now is just really exciting. Yeah. And what are the kind of inspirations behind the track as well? Because obviously it's taken us back to those sort of like noughties American kind of bands that we heard at the time, all that kind of sound. Is that sort of where you draw your influence from? Yeah. So, I mean, all of us are heavily influenced by like Blink-182, Green Day, Youngblood. You can probably tell a little bit by the track. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but yeah, no, there's real heavy influences in the music itself. Of course, everything we've written, to be fair. And what's your sort of musical background? I know you said you've been writing music since Feb this year, but have you been in bands before? Is this your first band, your first like time putting music out? or? Uh, so I've been a band, I've been two bands previously. Um, one was also pop punk, sort of a similar sort of style. Um, but the other was a bit, a bit heavier, a bit more like death tones. Um, so, yeah, done a bit of a mix, to be honest. <laughs> and how did this particular band get together then? Did you form in Feb? What was the story of that? Yeah, so we formed. That's when we formed. So um, the drummer Joe, um, I've known him for a long, long, long time. Um, so he's been a couple of bands previously. And we got talking and wanted to have another go at it, basically. Um, so we had a look and found Ryan, who's the singer. Um, had a little jam. We got them all about a month later. Got Tom, who's the other guitarist. And uh, yeah, it's all sort of kicked off from there, basically. Mm, exciting. Have you got any plans for gigs the rest of this year or next year? Sort of what are your your hopes for Wednesday at 7? Because you're still a fairly new band, really. Yeah, um, so our first show is booked on the 1st of December, and that's at the Leopard in Doncaster. Um, tickets are available online for that one. Um, I think they're £7 a pound booking fee, so £8 total. Um, and then going to next year, there's nothing booked currently, but next year is really when there are a few more songs out between now and then and really start like booking gigs in left, right and centre. So you should see more of us from December mm. onwards, really. Now that's exciting then. And how are you feeling about sort of like being on stage and stuff? Are you naturally quite shy or confident? How does it make you feel? It's an interesting one, you know. So it's something I've always thrived off. But I think the last time I played live on stage was 2015. So it's wow. eight years now. Oh, my so, gosh. So um, I used to love it, and I think I'm still going to love it. But I still feel like there's maybe like a little bit of nerves creeping in now. You know, it's like getting very close to actually playing again. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you'll be amazing though, but I can't imagine like you'll be all scared before. But then again, once the first hit of the instrument or, you know, sing of the mic comes in, you'll be absolutely buzzing and just loving it and buzzing off the audience as well. How can people um, check you out online, keep up to date with you, look out for new music? Uh, to be fair, the two best places are either Facebook or Instagram, and that is Wednesday at 7. But Wednesday, just drop all the vowels out of it and you'll find us. Why did you want to do that? Um, if I'm honest, when we first did it, it just looked cool and it stuck. <laughs> yeah. Well, it looks good, definitely. So that's W-N-S-D-Y at 7. You can find Rob and the rest of his lads. Thank you so much for coming on the show, Rob. Enjoy the rest of your night. You too, thank you very much.